This is exactly how I price my products on Amazon Wholesale FBA. The very first thing you need to understand is the following. Is the current seller in the buy box an FBA seller or an FBM seller? Based on one or the other, you will be pricing in two different ways. Against FBM sellers, guys, we have a massive competitive advantage. We can actually increase the price point and we will always win the buy box. Against FBA sellers, it's a whole completely different story. Obviously, you have to decrease your price point. Now, there's a specific way you need to look at the listing because you need to understand who the current seller is in the buy box. Based on different criteria, you will have to price it in different types of ways. Obviously, guys, if you see Amazon, my best advice at the moment is to just avoid it. Now, it actually doesn't mean you can't make money because believe it or not, on Amazon, you can still compete against Amazon, believe it or not. There is a specific criteria you need to follow, but at the moment, if you're just starting, just try to avoid it. But as long as you remember, FBA sellers, we decrease the price point, and FBM sellers, we increase the price point, that's a very good place to start.